Hi everyone. Today we will take one more new problem related to regression. When we have got two lines of regression, how we have to find out x bar, value of x bar, value of standard deviation and r, value of correlation. And when in the question statement, variance of x has been given, that is 12. So how we have to solve this problem? You can see here, this is the first equation and that one is the second e equation. And uh, in through this equation, when we have solved, we have got the x bar equal to 1, y bar equal to 2. But question is how we have to reach on this solution. So solution would be like this. This is my first equation, x plus 2y minus 5 equal to 0, 2x plus 3y minus 8 equal to 0. So what we have to do, we will, we will, here is solve equation first and second simultaneously. So you can see here, what is this 2x plus 2y minus 5 equal to 0, 2x plus 3y minus 8 equal to 0. These are the original equations you can see here. What we have to do after solving these equations, we will multiply upper one equation right with the, by 2. And after that, we will subtract this below equation from this equation. And finally, we will reach on this solution y equal to 2 answer you will get. After this, what we have to do, put the values of y, y equal to 2 in equation 1. So this is my first equation, x plus 2y minus 5 equal to 0. I will put the values of 2. I will put the values of 2 here in place of y. And this is the value of y. And I will put the value. So x bar equal to 1. Now, we have got the both the values y bar and x bar. You can see here now the solution I had given. After this, you can see here I put it all the same values x bar equal to 1, y bar equal to 2. Now, the next question, I want to calculate value of r. I want to calculate value of standard. This one is sigma square. And now what we have to do let me take equation 1 and this equation we are treating as regression line y on x. We are converting regression line y on x. So x plus 2y minus 5, this is my equation. So what will be when we have to for the solve 2y equal to minus x plus 5. And now finally y equal to minus 1 by 2 multiplied 1 by 2x plus 5 by 2. So b y x equal to minus 1 by 2. This is my regression coefficient. I have got b y x equal to minus 1 by 2. Similarly, let's equation to be regression line x on y. This was the y on x and this regression line x on y. So 2x plus 3y minus 8 equal to 0. That is my second equation. 2x equal to minus 3y plus 8. So x equal to minus 3 by 2, y plus 8 by 2. So finally, we have got regression coefficient x on y would be minus 3 by 2. So both the regression coefficient we have got. Regression coefficient y on x is minus 1 by 2. And regression coefficient there is, let me take, this is the regression coefficient. b y x equal to minus 1 by 2 and b x y equal to minus 3 by 2. Now, we, with the help of these regression coefficients, we can get the value of R. So, what is the formula? Value of R equal to, you can see here, value of R, B Y X multiplied by B Y X. We will put both the values minus 1 by 2 multiplied by minus 3 by 2. Because both the values we have got, these are negative values. Finally, we have got 3 by 4. And this is the final solution, 0 0.866. Byx and xy have negative values. So R, we are going to treat it as negative. So this is the final value of R. 
R equal to minus 0 0.866. After this, because variance of sigma x already, this one is the formula, sigma x equal to under root variance. So variance of x variable is already given in the question. Variance of x is 12. This value already given in the problem statement. And uh, this is the sigma x equal to under root variance. We will put the value of this variance equal to. So finally, we have got the value this sigma x is 3.46. Now, we know this formula b y x equal to r multiplied by sigma x divided by sigma y. So what we have to put it minus 1.5. This is b y x. This value we have already got. Our value of r we will put 0 0.866 multiplied by 3.46 because sigma x value is already given. Right. Divided by sigma y. So now sigma y equal to 2. Right. After solving this we have got this solution. And when we have to do sigma square y, that would be that would be 2 multiplied by 2 and final solution of this sigma square would be 4. So we have reached on all the solutions. We have got x bar, we have got sigma square y, we have got value of r also. So in that way, this is the process through which we can solve these kind of problems when only two line of regressions has been given. So I hope this video will be helpful to you. Keep watching. Stay tuned.